everybody, it's Professor Williams, and we're going to look at binomial distributions and probabilities using Minitab. In this case, we're going to solve for the probability of finding greater than or equal to a certain number within our sample. So we have a recent survey by the Knights of the Roundtable, and they found that despite popular opinion and rumors to the contrary, only 40% of dragons can actually breathe fire. In order to determine the size of their fire brigade, the knights very carefully take a sample of 20 dragons. What's the probability that seven or more dragons in the sample can breathe fire? This is a binomial distribution because we know that they can either breathe fire or they can't. So the probability of success is 40%. We have a sample or 20 trials. We want the probability of seven or more. So that means we're going to solve for the probability of greater than or equal to seven dragons in the sample that can breathe fire. All right, before we get started, we need to figure out what our input constant is going to be. So we looked at finding the probability of seven or more dragons that in this sample that could breathe fire. So I'm going to do my traditional line that tells me I have between zero and 20 successes and I want seven. And I want the probability of seven or more, so I have this equal to sign, which means I want to include seven. So what I'm looking for is actually the cumulative probability from seven up to 20 successes. What I don't want is zero to six. Well, because the probability from zero to six plus the probability from 7 up to 20 has to equal 1. If I can find this probability from 0 to 6 and subtract it from 1, it will give me 7 to 20. Remember that this CDF in Minitab solves for the probability that x is less than or equal to whatever our input constant is. So I've got to put in an input constant of 6 so that I eliminate 0 to 6 when I subtract from 1. So I'm coming up to calc, probability distributions, and I'm going to pick binomial. So I want a cumulative probability, and I had 20 trials. And I had an event probability. It's 40% chance they bred, breathed fire. Right? And I want an input constant of 6. So I'm going to put in 6, and I'm going to hit OK. So what Minitab tells me is the probability that six or fewer dragons breathe fire is right at 25%. What I know is that the probability that x is less than or equal to six is, and I'm just rounding this off, to 25%, which means that the probability that x is greater than or equal to 7 has to be that 75 percent. This is what the function in Minitab, this cumulative distribution function, solve for. And so in order to find my greater than or equal to 7, all I needed to do was take 1 minus the 25 percent. And that's how I got my 75 percent probability that seven or more dragons in the sample can actually breathe fire. As always, I hope that you found this useful, and thanks so very much for watching.